Good morning and welcome back to another vlog. If you are new to my channel, my name is Natalie and we have a big day today. So that is why we are up so early. And the big event today, the most important part of today is we are getting fitted for the Martinsville Xfinity car at our motorsports today. And I'm really excited. The race is coming closer and closer. And I just wanted to bring you all along with me today and show you what my day's gonna be like. I think I'm gonna need extra sugar in my coffee today. Good morning, everyone. Natalie told me to say I'm finally up, but it's still before eight o'clock, so it's early. She's struggling walking both dogs here. We got a, a long day, but I did promise yesterday Natalie a walk this morning, so that's what we're doing right now. I'm a happy girl this morning. We are back from our walk with the dogs. Derek is making us parfait, little fruit cups, yogurt, fruit, granola. And while I eat that, I'm gonna sign these cards. I have a lot of them to sign. We made it here to Our Motorsports. We're walking in right now. I'm pretty sure you were the last person to drive this, so it should be pretty close it to is. where you want, actually. It is pretty close to where I want it. I don't think I would move it right now. Perfect. So then I guess you were the last person to drive this one. I was pretty sure that was the case. It's good. Cool. That's what I like to hear. What are you doing? I was sitting on a ball that is made out of all the wraps from the shop. Actually, I think they said it was only about five races worth. No, all but five. Oh, all but five. Oh my gosh, that makes way more sense. <laughs> I was really confused, this is heavy. We are here at Fresh Chef. It's here in Mooresville. If you live close by, you gotta check it out. Thanks to Travis and Jess for showing us this restaurant because we absolutely love it. And we put in our order and we're currently waiting on our food. are gonna have to check this out it's really funny we're gonna walk in both dogs are gonna be super excited and then Penny's gonna bark but as soon as she realizes that we go to let cash out first she stops barking if we let her out first she just barks until cash is let out she is adamant on making sure cash is the first dog let out of his kennel it's funny done a lot so far today but I haven't gotten my workout in yet and I feel like I it's just really important to me right now to get a workout in every day no matter how I'm feeling because I have my Martinsville race coming up and I want to be strong so I'm gonna go to the gym I'm gonna get my workout in and then we'll probably make dinner after that. But 
as of like now, my favorite thing to do for a workout is 12, 3.30. And I learned that from a girl I like to follow on YouTube. Her name's Lauren. I even had Derek, my boyfriend, doing the workout for a while. But I like to do 12, 3.30. And that is where the treadmill's at an incline of 12. And you go speed of three for 30 minutes. But after that, I like to do a lot of yoga and like strength yoga. I'll show you, I'll show you when we get to the gym. If nobody's there, I'll show you guys. I notice such a big difference when I stretch my neck out. I don't know why, but if I like don't do yoga or stretch at all for a couple weeks, I have like horrible neck pain. But if I stay on top of it and I do some like stretches with my neck, I feel so much better. So try it. If you have neck pain and your neck ever feels stiff or sore, just try doing some neck stretches and see if it helps. All right. I did a little bit of light stretching to warm up, but let's go do 12 through 30. First thing I do is put the incline all the way up. I actually go to 13. I do say 12 through 30, and most people do it at 12, but I like to go to 13. And then I put the speed to three. And I sit here and do this for 30 minutes. I really like to watch YouTube videos to help make the time go by faster because like you are just walking, but it truly, it's difficult. And I just realized I didn't bring the water. I usually always bring the water. <laughs> I didn't bring my water, but I'll, I'm just gonna watch YouTube videos and make the 30 minutes go by fast. I finally have water. Derek's bringing me the charger because the camera's about to die. Just drop it. <laughs> I'm back home. I really only warmed up a little bit stretching and then I did 12 through 30 and then drop it, drop it, drop it. <laughs> and then after 12 through 30, like halfway through it, a bunch of people came in the gym and the gym's pretty small. So I'm back home and I'm gonna do my yoga routine right here in my living room. And I will show you a little bit of what I do and why I do it. Because it helps my shoulders and back and arms stay strong for driving the race car. <laughs> I really like to <laughs> start like downward dog and really stretch out my legs and just really just stretch everything out, right? But the main thing that I really like to do are these like weird push-ups where you go down and you push yourself back up and then you go back into downward dog. And I feel like I'm getting my stretch from the downward dog and I'm really strengthening my arms as I do. I don't even know what this is called but they're really freaking hard. So if you like working out and you like yoga and all that stuff, try them. I have a whole routine on all that stuff. Like, let me know down in the comments if you guys want me to walk you through like my whole yoga routine. My camera's about to die. Ah, I have to hurry up. Okay, let me know if you like, want me to walk you through that and show you more about what I do. But it's hard, it's difficult and I want to challenge you all to try it. Tonight for dinner, we are having one of my dad's favorite meals and one of Derek's favorite meals and it's called Salisbury steak. I don't know why it's called that or who came up with this recipe or how famous it is, but if you know what that is, comment down below. On the side, we're having potatoes and vegetables. If you don't know what a Salisbury steak is, it's literally a burger. It's a burger 
with no bun and you put gravy over it. Usually you have it with like mashed potatoes, but we're doing it a little bit different tonight. And we are gonna have just regular potatoes and delicious vegetables. I'm making this meal for you, Derek, tonight. I want you to have a meal that you love and enjoy. And I know this is one of your favorites. <laughs> He's been smiling like that behind the camera the whole time. So I just asked Natalie, I was trying to help her out and I was like, hey, you want me to film you while you season these potatoes? And she got defensive and she's like, no, you can't give away our secret recipe. I've never said she that. She was like really mean about this it. This is not a secret recipe. It's literally avocado oil, seasoned salt, pepper, and garlic. What are you, what are you no, talking about? No, you forgot about? about the secret ingredient, but that's okay, I'm gonna cut before you can tell them. We have Derek fully taking over the kitchen right now. <laughs> he just flipped the burgers and he's working on the gravy right now. He just came in here and was like, get out of here, let me do it. No, that's not how that works. Derek, I need a different spatula. I can't flip them. We are in bed. The puppies are in bed. I'm sorry we did not bring you along when we ate dinner. We have Travis and Jess here with us and they came home from work and we just wanted to spend time with them and eat dinner with them. And then we went to Cold Stone. I had ice cream twice today. <laughs> yeah, so we just got back from Cold Stone. Now we are going to go to bed. It's early too, it's nine o'clock. Like we go to bed early, we're, I feel like such an old person. We go to bed so early. We don't do anything crazy fun like kids our age probably do. Derek's over there watching Facebook videos like a dad. <laughs> we love you all so much. Thank you for watching my videos and supporting me. And I will see you all in the next vlog. Good night.